everyone, uh, everyone, none of them are God. Yes, there's a power. So start with your relationship with God. Uh, yes, faith in. Uh, Face him, being an ambassador for Christ, he start with uh, the spending time with him. You see, if you spend time with God, he will do what he, he did not even ask. Yes. Because he knows all your needs. Yes. And pour into relationship with those around you. Mm -hmm. So you start that relationship with God, and then the people that come around you, you pour out that relationship that you have with God with them. So people who have been studying scripture, people who have been fasting, people who have been uh, praying, when people come to them, you see out of what they have, they have, they have been uh, doing, uh, comes out of them uh, and then it grows into the people uh, and then you see transformation uh, and you will see testimony. Ask question. Uh, do not be afraid to ask God questions. Uh, if you do not understand something, ask him. He said, ask. Yes? And what? It shall be given unto you. Yes. Ask. You will receive. He said, seek. And you shall you find it. Knock. The door, the door will be open. Yeah. So begin to ask, seek, knock, ask, seek, knock. It doesn't matter how long it is, just ask, seek, knock, and you will see the answer comes. You see, when we don't ask a question, we don't get the answer. Sometimes your children don't ask you a question, they don't know. Right? But the one that ask, Thomas asked Jesus, and he got an answer. The rest were too afraid to ask. They soon will ask. Share your story. When God has done something for you, a testimony is not something just coming to prance around, whatever. It's just come from a grateful heart. Somebody will say, no, the Lord has done it for me. I'm grateful. Even if it's not perfect yet, by faith I receive yes. my healing. By faith yes. I receive my deliverance. Oh. By faith I receive that blessing. Amen. By faith, I, by faith I by yes. faith, the wife commenter. Oh. By faith, the children commenter. By yes. faith, I'm successful at work. I'm successful at school. Yes. By faith, yes. even though I might be struggling with the subject, I said, by faith, oh. and by the word of God, oh. I receive wisdom from above. Yes. And I begin to excel in the name yes. of Jesus. Yes. And then, when you share your story, invite others. You see, people like a place where good testimony has been taking place. They also want to partake. Invite others. You see, you share your story and then you invite them. You have a testimony time in my church. Uh, you have a testimony time and I want you to come and be my guest. Uh, you see, the Americans, they listen to the story, they see what the Lord is doing and they want to be a partaker of it. So, share your story. It's all part of being a better ambassador. And it's also good to reflect on what you've been doing as an ambassador. Attitude is everything. The attitude that you show, you might talk. You know, I work as a teacher in school. Some of our children, they claim to be Christian. They will talk, they talk, but they are the worst behavior in the class. So, why should anybody want to know their God? In fact, sometimes they say maybe they've never been taught. And it's not true. They've been taught. They just choose to, to show off what they could do at home. They're not doing it in school. Right? They're showing off. And they think they're showing off and impressing others. But they're not impressing others. They're actually turning people off. You say, well, if that's what they do, what they teach in your, in your church, then I don't want to know that God. So, you need to be to flow. Attitude. <laughs>